thought was, if I love Pokemon so much, then why am I sitting here? Why don't I go out just like Ash and Misty and Brock and catch all those Pokemon? You may say they don't exist, but I know they do. I've seen them. It's time I take a chance and go out into the world of Pokemon. Uh, Dad? Would it be okay if I take very few pairs of clothes and very few meals and very little water and rely on nothing but myself and my survival skills and go around the world and collect Pokemon all by myself even though I'm only a teenager? What? Of course not. That's ridiculous. That's preposterous. No way. No. Okay, go ahead. Really? Awesome. Sweet. I'm gonna go get ready. believe it. All this walking for an hour and a half and I still haven't found any Pokemon? <sighs> huh. I hear something. It's a Pikachu! Please work. Come on. Please work. Ugh, forget it. Pikachu, electric rodent, weighs like 10 pounds, nah, 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 special attack thunderbolt, nah, evolved form of Pichu, who was not in the original episodes, but for some reason is still as popular as Pikachu, uh, you know, I know what to do. Pika? I caught it! Which is weird because that rarely ever happens. Usually a Pokemon has to get weakened first. Hmm. You had to start out somewhere, kid. Was that you, Pikachu, inside the Pokeball? Pika! Aw, how nice. The Pikachu gave me a break just because I'm a new trainer. Yeah, that's why. Join in next week for another episode of Real Life Pokemon. Them is my real test.